There was once a day that I would pray for you I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too Sneaking looks up and down from across the room and Damn, what a hell of a view I feel good, you look great I like you, I can't wait Today is my extreme lazy day like, I've not done anything since morning This morning I woke up I was really tired yesterday, you guys After making that fried rice, cleaning the whole plates and all that then this morning I woke up and all I did was prepare breakfast for Jasmine. I went back to bed. I came out again, I think around 1 or 2. Prepared lunch, uh, freshen up and all that. Went back to bed. <laughs> I've not cooked. I wanted to make fish roll or meat bible. I don't have strength. Maybe I'll just do fish roll later. That's if I can. But if I can't, I'll do it tomorrow. Jasmine is here eating. She's eating her biscuits. I'm eating crackers too. I'm very hungry. I don't have strength to microwave rice. I'm eating biscuit instead. <laughs> you guys, today. Eh? It's extremely cold, hence my laziness. In north, it's um, snowing. In this side, it's snowing on top of the mountains, and everywhere is so cold. For that reason, eh? I don't even want to step out. You guys, Obi just came back. <laughs> Why did they preach like that? Are you tired? He <laughs> said, I'm back. <laughs> he did a bit of shopping. Jasmine. No, we have before. No, we have. Jasmine is helping now. Look at what Jasmine is doing. See. Okay, let Mama do it. What happened? What's that? Hmm, sorry. Sandwich breads. Jasmine, wait. My favorite biscuit, you guys. You need to try this biscuit. It's very good. Oh, this thing is uh, chicken. It's very nice too. I normally eat it with bread. Mandarin. This is my favorite rice. The one I used in cooking fried rice yesterday wasn't my favorite at all. Got milk. The okay, inside is filled up with rice. I can't bring them out. Tissue paper. I want to lose weight though, but my husband will be buying packets. A big crate of cola. Imagine. Calories. He'll be buying calories for me. See. I want to lose weight. If I they chop all this kind of thing, they drink all these things. Anyways, thank you, babes. Egg. We what happened to the egg is Okay, one crate of egg. Leave there, Jasmine. Jasmine, stop. I'm to break it. Granite oil. You guys, granite oil is very expensive right now. Before we used to buy this, like, was it not 5 euro? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it's 18 euro. They sell this. Things are very expensive. Hmm. For baking, this is um, flour. Vegetable mangi, Nigeria bread, hypermox, and yam. I'm going to prepare this yam now, like this evening. So let me just get busy now. What about this one? 250. 250. Uh, what about chicken? 250. 250. Bomo? 2 euro. Uh, Bomo is 2 euro. Uh, 250. Okay. Shaki. Shaki. 
I bought it. This one is how much? How is the scale is Hey guys, welcome back. Today I actually woke up very early. I went to get meat in Afro shop, the one I went the last time um, during the Christmas period. So, you guys, I wanted to take you guys along in the morning, but I woke up a bit late. I told my husband to wake me up. He didn't wake me, so I woke up late and I couldn't talk to you guys this morning before leaving. So. I want to show you guys the things I bought and the price. See, <laughs> things are very, very expensive. Before, I used to buy goat's meat, one kilo for five euro. Today, one kilo, seven euro. This Europe, things are not very expensive, all like before. People in Nigeria are crying and talking about the increase in commodities and all that for scarcity. <laughs> Here in Italy is times five. It's even worse now. I don't know when all this will end. This gomo is two euro for one kilo. So I bought two kilos. That two kilos is four euro. Now so you can see the show. Cow meat. This cow meat we used to buy it before in 2019 when I started going to this place to buy meat. 3 euro for 1 kilo. Before you know it was 4 euro after the increments and all that. Right now, 5 euro as of today. You can see the meat is fresh. See how it's looking. The meat is really fresh and good. So that's why I always go there. So this one right here is 4 kilos. It's 20 euro for 4 kilos. See. This one is Turkey. I really don't buy a lot of Turkey from them because I have Afro shop close to me that I can get all of this. So this one is one kilo is three euros. So I bought two kilos, six euros. Six euros for this two kilo. Though their own is more than these people own here. Yeah, their own is more um, cheaper. This is good things. This one, hmm. two kilo. You are seeing here is 14 euro because one kilo is seven euro. You guys, this is two kilo. Go since this 14 euro before, just add one euro to it. You buy three kilos now, only two kilo. 14 euro. This is chicken. I think this was 12 euro 50 cents. So I got two chicken. I don't really bother chicken like that. So I shall just bought two. I don't shake it. Maybe I'll be making pepper soup today. You see how clean their shake is looking. Like everything they sell is very, very fresh, neat. So this one was, I think, two euro or two euro fifty cents, if I'm not sure. I will just put the price on the screen so you will see it. So I got two kilos. And I saw it plenty of issue. I bought cow leg. I enjoy cow leg more than bomo, so I used to buy bomo and uh, cow leg, but I enjoy this more. I use it to cook soups, to anything. Why the bomo? I normally use it to do like bomo sauce, sorry. So this one, I think it was two kilos. Yeah, two kilos. This is two euro fifty cents for one kilo. Two kilo right here is five euro. It's still cheap though. Yeah, their things are quite cheap. But before it was way cheaper than this. Mm. I bought a body. You guys, this one. It leak water, eh? Follow me with here. This is four kilo. One kilo was two euro, I guess. So I got four kilos. It's much. This is four kilos. If you like um, all these assorted, mm. this one. <laughs> so I got fish. Their fish is very cheap. This one is 3 euro 50 cents for one kilo. I bought this seven for 10 euro. Jasmine is sleeping. Mm. So right now I will wash them. You guys yeah, see them. All of them are here. I'm going to wash them and portion them in the fridge. You guys already know, like I did the last one. I can't wait. I 
Trust me, stop that. Good morning, guys. Welcome back. We just woke up yesterday was very hectic for me and i was having migraine so this morning i decided to stay in bed i have a couple of things to do this morning but hey jasmine please keep quiet i just decided to rest a bit more so when jasmine woke up this morning and she slept back i decided to join her i know it's past 11 a.m now but i decided to start my day now my dear I cannot come and kill myself so i want to go and take breakfast jasmine has eaten hey jasmine has eaten so i want to go and take breakfast maybe i will still give her something sure you guys this is an unplanned uh, morning routine so if you are hearing sound is the heater the one that controls the hot water and the, the entire house heater in the morning like this after brushing my teeth i know you guys will be wondering where is jasmine she's watching cartoon in the kitchen so after brushing my teeth in the morning what i usually do is not every day shower sometimes when i'm in a good mood when i'm okay you know sometimes you don't even feel the vibe okay what i normally do is use my fascia wash to wash my face I use Neve this product here eh? mm. don't even joke with this Neve at all this Neve gel is everything I've been using this for how many years now? 3 to 4 years now it's very good. I've been using it on my lips. So this one I don't use it every day, once in a week or twice in a week. You guys, I just found out I'm wearing back of pyjama. Sorry about that. <laughs> so you see my face. This Nivea helped me when I was having acne. Like I was having terrible acne in 2020. It was one of the things I used that also helped me do. So I'm going to share that, but I don't know when, but I will just show you guys and share my acne journey, how I healed and all that. So after that, I use vitamin C oil. I'm not going anywhere today. So I don't, I don't care about, um, what's it called? Sunscreen, because I'm not going anywhere. So I'll just use, the vitamin C oil and that's okay so this is pretty much it for the morning I'm not going anywhere so later I'll have my bath and do the rest now I'm going to have breakfast guys <laughs> at this point i think we are the last person to remove decoration of christmas the christmas decor it's been long overdue right it's already end of january and we are just getting to do this because we've got a lot of stuff to do and i'm very lazy when it comes to removing decoration so 
Hobby is helping out. Even Jasmine is helping out. Look at Jasmine. Hey, Jasmine. Come on, my baby. Come on. Come on. Meanwhile, happy Sunday. Today is 29th of oh. January 2023. <sighs> Let's just finish doing all of these things and I'll see you guys later.